Hello and welcome to a video all about the complex speed sound chart. During this video we will talk about what it is, how it is used and how it can help your child. We will also cover a few extra sounds that we feel need recapping. So what is a complex speed sound chart? The complex speed sound chart is a chart that we use in school during Read Write Inc and it contains sound boxes to help with learning to read. We often refer to this speed sound chart during lesson time and when we have trouble spelling words. In this video, we will be covering what each box means and we will recap difficult sounds. There are four rows in the chart and we will cover each row separately. So the first row. In the complex speed sound chart, each individual box represents the same sound. So for example, F, two Fs and PH all make the F sound. Some sounds appear in more than one box. This is because they can make different sounds. We will go through the sounds that are highlighted in yellow. So let's start. F, O, M, N, R, S. Now you will see in the S box that there are lots of different letters that when put together make the S sound. For example, C, E. That is one of the ones that the children definitely find tricky, so bear that in mind. V, z, ch, f, n, ink. Now the second row. B, k. Now at the bottom of the k box, you will notice that there is the sound ch, which the children will know that when they put together makes the ch sound. So sometimes, unfortunately, when we read, we just have to know that the ch sound can actually also make the k sound. G, h, j, p, qu, t, u, x, y, ch. Now the third row. A, e, you will notice that in the e box, we actually also have the sound e, a, which the children know that when they put together, it is e cup of tea. Unfortunately, again, this is one of those sounds that we just have to learn that the e sound can also make the e sound. I, o, a, a, e, i, o. Now in this box as well, especially the last four boxes, you will notice that there are sounds that have a line drawn between them. These sounds are known as chatty friends or split diagraphs. What this means is it makes the exact same sound, but when you spell a word with this sound, you have to put a sensible letter in between the two letters there. So for example, for cake, the children will know that when they spell it, they will need to put a kicking cur or a K in between the A and the E because it still makes the same A sound, but they need to put the letter there. You will also notice that there are a couple of sounds highlighted in yellow and we will go through those right now. OK, so the first sound that we've got is I and it comes in our I box. I'm going to set you a little challenge now so you can pause the video and see if you can come up with any words that have the I sound. Off you go. OK, we're now going to have a look at some together. So if you didn't manage to find any words with I, that's OK, because we are all still learning. So let's have a look. As always, we are going to do your turn and then my turn for a change. So when you see the word, I want you for, to Fred talk it and then blend it together. That is exactly what I will do afterwards. So let's have a go. P I pie. Oh, I lie. F -er eyes fries. One of my favourite things. Let's go. F -er eyes flies. T -er eyes tries. Tries is one of those tricky words that actually when you say the word it does sound like it have it should have the ch sound but it's one of those words that we just need to learn that it is tries. Next word and last one.
that word's got lots of special friends, so let's Fred talk it. B-U-T-T-E-R-F-L-I-E-S. Butterflies. Brilliant. Now we have the E sound. Now this E sound is exactly the same as the other chatty friends that we have or the split diagraphs that some of the children might know. So what we have to do is make sure there is a sensible letter that goes in between those two S's when we spell it. So again, the same challenge. I wonder if you can come up with any words that have got the E split diagraph. Now that is tricky because these words are trickier. So have a go. OK, we're going to have a look at some words together now. So don't worry if you didn't manage to find any. We're going to do the same thing again where you Fred talk and blend it together. And then I'm going to Fred talk and blend it together. So let's go. P eat Pete. K o m p o eat complete. E m theme. Even even. That's a tricky one because the e chatty friend split diagraph is actually at the beginning of the word, which sometimes makes it a little bit trickier. Next one. D e u e t delete. O n k r e e t, concrete. Brilliant. Okay, our fourth row, which is our last row. So let's have a look. U, u, r, o, e, e, o, u, o, e, o, y, a, e. Uh, as you can also see that we have some more sounds that are highlighted yellow, so we will go through those together. OK, now it is time for our last sound and it is the OR sound. So this sound is found in the OR box. Again, I'm going to set you the challenge to see if you can come up with some words that do have the OR sound. And if you can't, don't worry. OK, let's have a look at the first one. So again, your turn, then my turn. P -ors pause. You can see that I've highlighted two special friends in this word. That is because the S and the E, we can actually find them in our S box. So I hope you did manage to get that one. That was a bit tricky. Next one. O -o Launch. Author. Author. That word was actually super tricky because it had three special friends. Next one. Haunted. Haunted. Org, ast, august. And the last one. S or s source. Brilliant. Again, that one had another tricky special friend. Fantastic. We hope that this video has been useful and now know a little more about the complex speed sound chart. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope it has been helpful and we will see you soon.